So today is my first training with Lance from Obsession Archery. He's been building me my own specialized bow. When I was a kid, my first bow was actually made out of oak wood, parachute cord, and some bowstring. So this is totally different from me. And I'm really appreciating the time that he's spending with me to get me to be able to learn how to actually um, use some of the new technology out there for archery season that will be coming up. So thank you so much, Lance, for your time. I'm just using a handheld because it's just convenient. I don't have to put a wrist drop on. But the stroke is the same. So if you do a traditional archer's pull straight back here and you're a bodybuilder, what muscles and what muscle, what two primary muscles are we using? In this? So a rear delt lats. Real, rear delt. Real delt and lats. Rhomboid. Rhomboid, yeah. And very small a little portion bit of, your of back. the lat. Okay. Right? So <clears throat> if I do went to your gym and they did a forward grip wide pull up, right. what muscle is that? That's your lats. Yeah, almost exclusively the lats. Right. So, and that which muscles are bigger? Um, well, they're longer. The lats are longer, mm -hmm. but the rhomboids are thicker and shorter and smaller. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna translate that motion to this. Okay. Right. So we're using the bigger, longer, lat bigger, muscle. longer lat. Right. But watch what I'm doing with my front hand because I don't want to be doing this. Because if something goes wrong, that arrow is going, you know, to your neighbor. So I'm going to actually lean at the hip. I'm going to point the arrow at the target. I'm going to pull high across and then settle into my anchor point. This is obviously really short for me. Right. Let's see how you did. <laughs> the trainer, how did he do? I re-zeroed your sight. You were hitting... Left. To the left, yeah. Yeah. Was okay. it when you, when you're shooting, it was also hitting to the left? I was hitting to the left. Yeah, it was a sight. That okay. Was a sight. All right. Lean into it at the hips. At the hips. Only the hips. Like that? Only the hips. Okay, here. Look at me. So I'm going to mirror you. Here. That's what I do? No, no, you're not doing that. You're, oh. you're uh, doing... So you're doing like that? Yeah, yeah, at the hips. Oh, Hitch like a hips. abdominal crunch, oblique crunch. Okay. So that changes the angle of your stroking arm. No, no, no. Oh, stop, stop, stop. So um, I hope I can get a pull because sometimes I can only get three. You may also be fatigued because if you're working out well, every my, day. Yeah, and my rhomboids and everything have been right. what I've been doing. Yeah, that lot. release is too long for you. What? That release is about an inch and a half too long for you. You can already tell? Yes. Oh, yeah. okay. So. And that's why I sold you the other one. Yep. So you're. This Try is to it. point point the arrow. The, you watch the arrow and then point it at the target. Yeah. And then, you know your uh, stroking arm? Uh-huh. Picture it going over your forehead. Like that? Yeah. So right here? Yeah. So right there, that's adaptation. Okay. So um, there's also physical therapy and oh. all kind of other cool things. So the process is I'll, I'll set up my feet relative to the target, the rear foot slightly forward. That opens the hips, also opens the torso for the shot. I'll hook in, I establish my grip, remember that 35 degree angle on the knuckles? Get that grip, and then set up, shot through. Then I go to my anchor point, which is a bone-on-bone -bone connection. I'm kind of squishing myself into your bow, and then I execute the shot. <clears throat> Not bad for a teacher. You can definitely see I didn't have the best training session, but practice makes perfect. You can find Lance on www.obsessionarchery.net. Have a great day. We'll see you next time.